morning everybody and welcome to Vlogmas Day 16! I'm just about to take the boys on the school run. Oh, actually, I need to get Liam dressed and then take him on the school run. Um, but Eight first, let's see what them until... pesky elves have been up to. Eight more days until Christmas, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, what have they done? Um, Liam, um, Liam made two reindeers and now they're climbing inside of them. And they're <laughs> pretending to be reindeers. Got like reindeer costumes on, aren't they? So the kids are all dropped off at school and I'm just heading out with Rachel to town. Um, it's my last child free shopping day. So there's a fair few bits that I just want to pick up. Um, not big bits, they're all just like little niggly bits. But I want to try and do it before Liam's off on Wednesday. And we've got Tyler's nativity tomorrow so can't do it tomorrow. So literally today is the last child free shopping day. So yeah, I'm excited. Yeah, Rachel's going to be a scene and then we're off to town. So I'm back home from shopping. I think I literally just vlogged me walking down the centre because that was literally, I started getting bags and I had a Costa drink. Um, I actually ordered the Irish Velvet and Cream Hot Chocolate Costa. Um, the queue was massive. Got there, ordered it. They literally gave me the coffee. They gave me the Irish Velvet and Cream coffee. I was so, so gutted. And it's just like one of them things like, I queued for ages um, and like we were running a bit late we had to keep, get going because um, Rachel had to go pick up Zach from school so it's like I don't have time to go back wait for them to make me another drink and everything like that we were already running late so so my mum literally worked around the corner so I literally dropped off to my mum I was like here you go mummy enjoy your coffee <laughs> She thinks I legit bought it so so is mum they just gave me the wrong order so I came and gave it to you love you Picked up a few little bits in Poundland um, for the boys and stuff, which I'm not going to show. I also picked up some batteries and some like sweet cheeks, things like that, and some other little bits for the boys. So I got Ron a Christmas jumper from Primark. It was £16. I think he's probably going to hate it, but he wanted a Christmas jumper, and they're not allowed to look cool. Like, they have to be embarrassing and loud. Um, and it lights up, which is even better. So, that's Ronald's Christmas jumper. <laughs> um, again, I've got loads of little bits and pieces for the boys, which I'm not going to show. Um, a couple of bits I grabbed for myself. Grabbed myself some Minky Dupes from Primark, um, and they were £2 for two. Um, I love these kind of antibacterial cloth cleaning cloths so yeah really happy with those and i also grabbed the full slash queen mascara and um, it's their three pound mascara and apparently it's meant to be incredible so i might test this out tomorrow i've already got mascara on today but let me know if you want to see me testing that out tomorrow um, and yeah, that's sort of everything that I picked up. When I came home just now, the, my um, December Degusta box is outside my door. Um, just, or well, actually it was by my bins, thrown in my bush. Um, so I'm just gonna get that now and let's unbox the December Degusta box and see what food we got. Wishing you a Merry Christmas and a New Year full of surprises from Degusta box. Um, and we've got this here. Ooh, right, we don't have any products of the month this month. Um, but let's have a look and see. <gasps> Gosh, there's a lot. Right, what have we got here? First up, we have crunches. What are these? So they are UFIT crunches, sea salt and vinegar. UFIT crunches offer the ultimate high protein and health on the go snack in the form of a delicious high protein pop chip with no more than 158 calories in each bag. UFIT crunches come in three tasty flavors, smokehouse barbecue, sea salt and vinegar, and Thai sweet chili flavor. So this is sea salt and vinegar. 
You know I'm going to have to try it. <laughs> Mmm. Mmm. Very really good. Next up we have the Made Good Granola Bars. And you will get one, you'll get one of the three in your box with you. So there's an option of chocolate banana, chocolate chip, or mixed berry, and you're gonna get one of those. Let me try the mixed berry, because they sound really good. I love granola. Ron's going to love these because they're really healthy. So they're allergy friendly and a school safe snack as well. So I can even send these in with the boys. Mmm. Mmm. The mixed berry ones are delicious. Next up we've got some Arden's Twists. And these are the Grie... 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 <laughs> and spinach twists. So let's try one of these. Mmm. These are really good. These are actually available in Waitrose and they're £1.75 a box. These are delicious cheese twists. Oh my gosh. Mmm. They're delightful. I love them. I'm assuming this is the alcohol box this month. Um, so we've got a vermouth and tonic spritz, um, which is 5.5% alcohol. So Ron's gonna love that. And then I've also got this, which is a Lagoon Eaters Daytime Session IPA. So this is a light slammable beer, boldly dosed with a glorious fortune of hops. Um, and it's 4% alcohol this one. So there you go, got two little alcohol drinks which look really cute. We've also got an alcoholic cocktail gummy, which sounds really interesting. And this is cocktail confectionery. Um, and it's blended with a real cocktail with premium spirits, fresh fruit and syrups. Each gummy contains half a shot and a vegan. That's pretty cool. And you're going to receive one of these gummies in your box and that's really cool so ron's got a fair few little things and that's seven percent alcohol that is right now this is more my cup of tea <laughs> so we've got the ot's green tea cranberry cherry and strawberry tea bags which look really cool. So it's 12 biodegradable tea bags in there. And it says, ideal as a healthy mid-afternoon treat. Enjoy this classic tea that's been enhanced by sour cherry, zesty cranberries, and exotic Asian aromas of fragrant lemongrass and bamboo leaves, complemented by sweet apples, classic strawberries, and a touch of cornflower blossoms. This tea strikes the perfect balance between sweet and sour. That's amazing. And this is 3.39 and it's available at OTs.com, Amazon, and Ocado. So that's very cute. I love candy kittens. These are incredible, guys. And um, candy kittens are just like a sweet. And um, if the cold weather is getting you down, transport yourself to paradise for our delicious new sweet, tropical mango. It will be joined in our vegan range, which are also gluten-free and dairy-free. Use natural colors and flavor and things named real fruit juice. These are available at Morrisons and CandyKittens.co.uk. Um, I tried these at the Spirit of Christmas Fair and they are so good. Candy Kitten, they just like sweeties. Mm. Oh, I'll be hiding them from Ronald. Mm. Next up, we've got the Indie Base Snacks um, chocolate pretzels. And we've got a dark chocolate and a milk chocolate and you'll receive two in your boxes as well. Um, our new bites are a sweet treat that indulgent and still packed with benefits. They're still made with ancient grains, they're still a source of fibre. Let's try them milk ones. Let's try milk chocolate. Oh, I didn't, I thought they'd be actual pretzels. Mmm, they're good, they're really nice. Right, next up I've got this King Monty 
um, mini chocolate snacks in pop rice and sunny orange. I feel like this would be the alcohol alternative because um, there's nothing else or there's nothing written about it on the sheet. So I feel like this would be the alcohol alternative as well, guys. Um, but I'll leave all the information down below for you guys just in case you are interested. This is the Very Lazy Chopped Garlic. I love this. Garlic crushing and garlic chopping is like one of the banes of my life. I hate it. Even though I've got like a garlic mincer, everything else like that, I just, I just hate chopping garlic. So the fact that it's chopped up, ready and all fresh for me is amazing. So yeah. So I'm actually gonna really enjoy using that. It's gonna be so handy. These are Vietnamese jumbo wrapped cashews. Now I love cashew nuts. Mmm. They are good. Look at the size of them. Mmm. They're really good. These are worth three pounds and they're available at Sainsbury's, guys, just in case you're wondering. Really good cashew nuts, them. Love that. Last but not least, we've got two blue dragon kits, which I'm really excited about. This is their new street food teriyaki skewers, which looks incredible. <gasps> so excited to try that. So you marinate the diced chicken and thread it onto the skewers, grill, and then sprinkle over the sesame seeds and serve with the remaining teriyaki sauce. That sounds incredible. Super excited to give that a go. Oh, I'm gonna eat it all up. And then we've also got their Thai holy basil stir fry, which is also new. That's really exciting. It's got all like the toppings and stuff and all the different pastes and stuff you need for your stir fry. So both of them look great. They're gonna go right in my cupboard and I will be cooking them very, very soon. Super excited for that. And yeah, guys, what an incredible box. I love it. I've got some drinks that I can give to Ronald. I've got some teas that I can try. I've got loads of little healthy snacks. <gasps> and the cheese straws are going to be what I'm going to have for lunch right now. So, yeah. Going to put all this away in my cupboards now. And I'll see you in a bit, guys. So, I'm back home now with the boys. I've got them both with me now. Waiting patiently to do their advent calendars. So that's what we're gonna do now. Um, and then I'm gonna stick on dinner. My dad's favorite one, yeah? Coca Cola. Happy Cola. I like Happy Cola. Reindeer. Finally. It's our favorite animal. Reindeer. So day number 16 and they both got a reindeer in the advent calendars which are just so cute. Evening all. Um, what an evening it's been. Um, I have just finished decorating my tree for the fourth time this year since putting it up. So I decorated the first time. Uh, the lights blew on it so I had to decorate it a second time. Then we had... Mel over with the kids on Saturday and Oliver pulled the tree down um, so I had to decorate it a third time and then I had my lights blow on me again so I've just finished decorating it for the fourth time <laughs> um, these are the lights that I've um, had for the last few years actually so I know they're going to be fine so I know I won't have to do it again um, but we actually got given some lights from Ron's mum and dad when they came over from India. Um, we had like two brand new sets of lights. Um, so they were really, really pretty lights and I really wanted them to work. But I just think um, the change in the wattage and the actual like electric difference and stuff um, probably just blew them. Um, which is a shame because my actual um, curtain lights that I have on my backdrop are from India as well and they work perfectly fine. So I'm not too sure what the problem was um, but I know these ones are going to keep working because I've had them for the last few years on my Christmas tree. So it's decorated for the fourth time. A little bit out of breath trying to sort it all out. My hair is an absolute mess. Finished having dinner, we had pizza and salad and then the boys decorated the rest of the biscuits that were in here. Um, so it's just got like the icing 
pipe tubes left in it. <laughs> so they've done that as well for their puddings. So they had fun doing that. Um, they're just about to go to bed in about half an hour. So pretty soon I'm going to start letting them do their storybook advent calendar and then they'll go to bed. I'm really not sure what to do tonight. I mean, I've got another load of washing that I need to hang up. I've hung up one already today. Um, so I need to hang up one load of washing. I need to place an order on Sweet Shop, so I'll probably do that this evening because um, they've just given me my discount code. Um, so I've got a 15% off discount code, which is Sammy Lou. So, so if you guys were interested, Sweet Shop do um, the jars of um, sweets that I use in the Vlogmas intro, and they do loads of like boxes of pick and mix and all sorts. So I do have a 15% off discount code, which is just Sammy Lou. I'll leave a link down below for you guys, just in case you're interested. Um, but I do need to place an order for them because their last date for ordering is the 18th. Um, before Christmas and it's now the 16th so I've got two days to place my order to guarantee Christmas delivery so that's exciting so the plan I think I've sussed it out I'll do the kids storybook advent calendar put the kids to bed then order my sweeties and do the bits of online shopping that I need to do and then open my advent calendars and then have a bubble bath maybe a sheet mask and do my nails. I think that is the best idea. That is a good idea. Right, let's do that. Guys, this toy is called Advent Calendar. Well, there's lots of things. Beauty and the Beast. Aww. Prince refused to give an old beggar woman shelter in his castle, but the old woman was really an enchantress. Oh, you better watch out, you better not cry, better not pout, I'm telling you why. Santa Claus is coming to town! Woo! Good job, Lim! So Liam decorated a bauble at nursery today. Show the baubles, Alan. <laughs> it's so cute. Do you want to put it on the tree? You can go put yeah. it on the tree if you want. That's it. Gently put it on. There you go. That way. And he also made two tree toppers. Right, go then put them on then, darling. Cool. Yay! Good job, Liam. Night boys. Love you. So in my Cop Beauty Advent Calendar yesterday I got a vitamin C paste from Lixir Skin, which I'm super excited to try. It's a morning mask, so I won't be able to try it tonight, but I'm really excited for that. And in day number 16 I have an original beauty blender, which I'm so excited to try. I'm going to try and do my makeup with it tomorrow um, so you guys can see how that works. I'm so excited. I've never tried an original beauty blender before. I've only ever used the like dupe beauty sponges. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited to see what the difference is going to be with that. And now it's time for my marshmallow advent calendar. And again, I've got two days. I've got open day number 15 and day number 16. I've got salted caramel in day number 15. And day number 16 is... S'mores! Skincare routine is done. I've got a unicorn face mask on from Incredible, which I think is super cute, but scary at the same time. Let's get the bath going. So guys, I'm out of the shower, I've got my comfy PJs on, and I'm just about to start editing this vlog. Um, I was actually so impressed with my skincare routine this evening, so I thought I would share it with you, what I used. Literally only a couple of products. I used the Good Molecules Instant Cleansing Balm. I've been using this a lot recently to take off my makeup life. I've got some dinges in there, um, but it's so, so good. I've been really, really loving it. So I used that. 
Then I used the Radical Skincare Express Delivery Enzyme Peel. This was so, so good. It's like a jelly and you apply a thin layer onto your skin and then you just keep going in circular motions for like three to four minutes and then you can feel your dead skin coming off. Like, sounds gross, really satisfying to do um, and your skin is so soft after. Then I just popped on a face mask and it was the Sparkle Like a Unicorn Illuminating Sheet Mask by Incredible and it was incredible it was so good like my skin is so moisturized it's beautiful i literally don't have to do anything else now i'm gonna put on one of my laneige lip sleeping masks which i got from yes style and then that is it that's my skincare routine done my hair's done <sighs> my bath is done i'm all nice and relaxed literally gonna end this vlog now and start editing because i've got tyler's nativity in the morning that i'm gonna go and watch um, so I won't have time in the morning to do it. Really hope you liked this vlog though guys. If you did, don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and subscribe down below to see more from me. And hopefully I will see you guys in tomorrow's Vlogmas video. Take care. Bye. <laughs>